Do you have any questions? Do you have any questions, sir? I hope that's on video. Thank you. What's up, everybody? It's the Bogey Smalls in the building. And we're back at it again with another course vlog. Now, this is the same course we played in course vlog number one. I'll put a link uh, for you to so you can go back and view that one. We're playing this one with my buddy Double Rob. He's a very good golfer, about a seven or eight handicap. And when we get together, it's always fun because uh, he's always a jokester. And uh, you'll see that right from the get-go. Just freak on the tee. Famous golfer. First hole on ESPN Ocho. Now pay attention to the neon green on the tip of the shoes. That gives him direction. There he is. He has his sights lined in. He's teed up. Back straight, club down. Here we go. Got it. Ladies and gentlemen, we're in the fairway. We're, but we're not gonna mention we're in the wrong one. So there you go, right from the jump, he's already got some jokes cracking on me. But if you heard him say, got it, that will come here in the, later on as uh, when we spot each other, we always like to say, got it. Let them know that uh, the other person that we uh, got their ball in sight. If you're not already subscribed to the channel, please make sure you hit that uh, thumbs up and also hit the bell so that you know that we are putting out new content every Monday and every Thursday at two o'clock. So I'd miss this putt and I'd turn around and get it on the second try, but. As you can see, a new addition to the channel is I'm starting to toy with the shot tracer and uh, add that to the mix. Um, I think it adds a little bit of uh, added element uh, to the content and I hope you guys enjoy it. These next couple pitches I would leave short. You would see right here with my frustration. I do the same thing on this one too, leaving it short. I'd redeem myself on the uh, putt, however, you won't be able to see it because I was unaware that the camera fell down. So on hole three here, I would actually hit a runner that actually overflew the green. So I'd pitch this back and then I'd actually end up two putting here, getting this one close. Or actually, I think I actually, nope, I uh, hit this one long, uh, but I get it on the second time. So one of the themes that you'll see with the bogey smalls is I tend to top my shots, but it doesn't get any better than this right here. <laughs> yeah. So I'd hit my third shot up to the left of the green, pitch it on, and then that's when I would get a lesson from Coach Double Rob. I do this, I'm not telling you to do that. Everyone has their own grip. I'm not I'm not telling you how to grip it. What I am telling you is your hand should never be like this. You want it as stable because there shouldn't be any bend. You don't want it like this. You want it as far down but still touching as possible. It doesn't matter if you have the claw, if you reverse it, all the pros, none of them are like this. Everyone is separate as far as possible within reason to be comfortable. There you go. Now try it. You're gonna have a better stroke. Look at that. Look at that. Do you have any questions? Do you have any questions, sir? I hope that's on video. Thank you. Unbelievable. If you guys want lessons, I'll get you in touch with them. <laughs> so this 
next shot on this drive, I'd hit a beautiful drive up towards the right, and then my approach shot in would actually hit off the side bunker and actually kick over onto the green to the hole. I'd make the putt, and then we would move on to the next hole. On my tee shot for hole six, I'd actually hit it short, just right of the green. Here's my pitch on. Nice shot. And I got it on there pretty good. Very nice. And I'd sink my putt here. So on this drive on hole seven, you'll see on the left-hand side, there's a tower there and there's some uh, hills. I hit it just short of the hills in the fairway. And then on my approach shot, I thought I did shot trace on this one, but I guess I didn't. I hit it uh, short to the right of the green. And then I pitch it on. Unfortunately, I didn't get the putts on this uh, hole. I'm having some issues with my GoPro that I'm trying to get figured out with the battery. On hole eight, I would actually hit a good shot here to the left of the pin on the green. And then I would, two, I think I two putt here. And then every once in a while, I put together some high, nasty, straight, bombs. Well, then I like to follow it up with what I call a practice swing. <laughs> if you heard him, he said, got it. <laughs> I was still laughing after that and couldn't recoup myself on this next shot. I'd eventually make this pitch shot up on the green and then from there we would close it out with a two putt. Once again everybody please make sure that you subscribe to the channel it's greatly appreciated. Hit that like button so it gives uh, more people the opportunity to see these videos. Don't forget about the Jagman Joe uh, giveaway that's going on if you do have an OptiShot simulator. Uh, you can pick that up if you look at my uh, videos in the description. Thanks again, everybody, for your support. It is greatly appreciated. Take care, everybody. Make sure you live life above par.